So uh, that's not all. I'm not quite done with Scheinberg. He his, oh, his final, probably his most famous suggestion was one that didn't come off. <laughs> He'd also <laughs> done some research and found that no hit film had, had ever had future in the title. So he said, we can't, we got to change the name. And he suggested they change it to Spaceman from Pluto. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the future. I don't like it. I don't like, I don't like it. You know, one of the kids are talking about Pluto, that new planet Pluto. It's the most recently discovered planet. Everyone loves Pluto, right? Am I right? You know what else right. they love? You know what else they love? Spacemen. Spaceman. Here's what I'm thinking. We put them together. <laughs> Spaceman from Pluto. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Scheinberg, you've done it again. Scheinberg's my new hero. Z- Zemeckis was like, I but- don't like that name very much. That's... It's- and and he so he got he he contacted Spielberg. He's like, <laughs> Spielberg, can you call like, it? You're the Shine- only one that Scheinberg respects. Yeah, pretty much. He's like, yeah, the Bergs. He's like, geez, their names are very similar. There's yeah. only a couple. Anyway, is that a conspiracy? I wonder. Same but, person. Um, you never seen us in the same room. Do you think? Yeah, it's <laughs> it's Steven Spielberg doing a character. Yeah. Imagine. It's me, Sidney Scheinberg. <laughs> That's why he keeps saying his name like, to remind like, himself. Uh, is that you, Steven? I gotta go! <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Sydney! It's like, it's like Mrs. Doubtfire. <laughs> He's got two, dim, I got, two dinners. I've got, got to put my face in some cream right now. 